worth, as it is, about four to five hundred thousand dollars. And you can see, this is 251, number two, who was ever built. For a few of them, they'll run and run. They did, they tell me, this is a real thing. You know what? I say to everybody in this world, you just want it. If you regret what you wanted to do, it makes you a fool. I never regretted any car I bought. Every single car I have in here, because I love it. And that's why I have these people. Otherwise, I'll have a bunch of Renault Speed and Renault Megan and Toyota Corolla and, and stuff. Those are fine looking cars. And if I'm ever over in London, I'll look you guys up. So you can look me up. Those of us with a passion of motorsports gotta stick together. Like a brotherhood. Well, that's does it for hot rides and cool whips. I hope you guys had a blast. I'm Mad Mike. See you next time. See you. Thanks for joining me for some stunts and chaos. I'm Michelle Lombardo, your host for the ball. next Go fast. Go on. 30 minutes. And I promise you, go on. Go move the ball. Ride because we're going to ride shotgun with a pretty chick who knows how to drift. We're going to free fall with a guy who's addicted to base jumping. And we're going to show you a really awesome race for high performance scoopsies. But first, it's time for some big wave surfing. So, once upon a time, the Hawaiian Islands were known as the place to go to catch the biggest surfable waves in the world. But there are two California surf spots that are just as gnarly as anything Hawaii has to offer. One of them is Mavericks, which most of you have definitely heard of. The other spot isn't quite as well known unless you're a professional surfer. It's called Ghost Trees, and it was discovered fairly recently off the 18th pole of Pebble Beach. So let's go there right now.
fire Choking on the ash of my desire